There are basically two types of carbs, simple carbs and complex carbs. Simple carbs are usually present in sugary foods and processed foods, while complex carbs are found in whole grains, fruits, and vegetables. And did you know that certain complex carbs, especially those rich in soluble fiber, can help reduce LDL, the bad kind of cholesterol that can clog up your arteries and lead to heart problems? So in today's episode, we'll tell you about the seven carbs that can lower your bad cholesterol and offer better heart health. Let's begin. Number one, oats. Oats are a rich source of carbohydrates, dietary fiber, protein, and many essential nutrients, making them a nutritious and wholesome addition to your diet. They contain a special type of soluble fiber called beta-glucan, which is known for its cholesterol-lowering effects. When you eat oats, the beta-glucan forms a gel-like substance in your gut, which binds to cholesterol and bile acids. Actually, the liver produces both cholesterol and bile acids. Bile acids help in digestion, and cholesterol is used for many bodily functions, including the production of cells and hormones. The liver also uses cholesterol to make bile acids. After the bile acids have done their part in digestion, the rest of them get reabsorbed into the bloodstream via the small intestine and get back to the liver for reuse. Beta-glucan binds to bile acids, preventing them from being reabsorbed into the bloodstream. This way, the liver has to use more cholesterol from the bloodstream and use that to make new bile acids. Ultimately, this process helps to reduce the amount of LDL cholesterol in the blood, effectively lowering bad cholesterol levels. Not just that, but many studies show that consuming oats regularly can significantly reduce bad cholesterol levels, leading to a lower risk of getting cardiovascular diseases. Before we move on, please take a moment to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. If you find our videos helpful, please support us by becoming a patron. Number 2. Barley Just like oats, barley is also rich in fiber, and that's why it performs almost the same in our bodies as oats. Their soluble fiber forms a gel-like substance in the digestive system and binds with bile acids, preventing them from being reabsorbed into the bloodstream. As a result, the liver has to make use of excess cholesterol from the bloodstream and uses it to make bile acids. Eventually, this helps to reduce LDL or bad cholesterol from your arteries, leading to overall better heart health. But that's not all. Barley contains a special type of soluble fiber called hemicellulose, which is especially effective in reducing bad cholesterol levels. In fact, hemicellulose can lower cholesterol more effectively than many other grains and cereals, making barley a standout choice for heart health. Another cool thing about barley is its low glycemic index. This thing measures how quickly a food raises blood sugar levels after eating. Barley's low GI helps stabilize your blood sugar levels and provides a sustained release of energy. This can not only make you feel full and satisfied for a long time, but can also lower the risk of developing inflammation in your blood vessels due to high blood sugar. So if you are looking for the best carbs that can lower your bad cholesterol, barley might just be perfect for you. Number 3. Nuts Nuts are a great source of unsaturated fats, including monounsaturated and polyunsaturated fats. Studies show that the monounsaturated fats in nuts can lower LDL cholesterol without affecting HDL cholesterol levels, which is a good thing. Not just that, but nuts are also packed with fiber, which plays a major role in cholesterol management. Another special component of nuts is plant sterols. These compounds have a similar structure to cholesterol, and if you have more plant sterols and less cholesterol in your diet, your body will be absorbing more plant sterols to make up for its cholesterol needs. This way, they can prevent too much cholesterol from entering your bloodstream, lowering LDL cholesterol levels. Isn't it amazing? Number 4. Whole Grains Unlike refined grains, which have had the bran and germ removed during processing, Whole grains retain all three parts of the grain kernel, the bran, the germ, and the endosperm. This composition makes whole grains a nutritional powerhouse. First off, whole grains are quite rich in both soluble and insoluble fiber. They are also great sources of many vitamins, minerals, and phytochemicals, contributing to your overall better heart health. 
For example, magnesium in whole grains has been linked with lowering blood pressure and reducing the risk of heart disease. Antioxidants like phytochemicals help protect your blood vessels from free radical damage, reducing the risk of developing atherosclerosis and heart disease. To include more whole grains into your diet, you can try whole grain versions of your favorite foods, like whole wheat pasta, whole grain bread, and whole grain cereals. Number 5. Beans Beans can be a great addition to your diet, especially if you are looking for carbs to lower your bad cholesterol. One of the primary reasons for their cholesterol-lowering effects is their high soluble fiber content. Another interesting thing about beans is that they are rich in flavonoids and phytosterols, both of which have antioxidant properties. They help neutralize harmful free radicals in your body, which otherwise could damage your endothelial cells, ones that make up inside walls of your arteries. Eventually, this helps to keep your blood vessels flexible and less prone to develop plaque in them. In addition to their cholesterol-lowering benefits, beans are an excellent source of plant-based protein making them a valuable option if you are a vegetarian or a vegan. The protein in beans and their fiber content can help you feel fuller for longer, helping you to lose weight quickly. Number 6. Citrus Fruits Citrus fruits, like oranges, grapefruits, lemons, and limes, are not only delicious but can be very good for your heart health, particularly if you want to lower your bad cholesterol. Citrus fruits contain a group of compounds called flavonoids, specifically hesperidin. Hesperidin has antioxidant properties, so that can help protect your cells from oxidative stress. Another powerful antioxidant in citrus fruits is vitamin C, which not only offers cardioprotective effects but also has immune-boosting properties. Some studies show that vitamin C can even prevent LDL cholesterol from oxidizing. Oxidizing is what makes LDL kind of sticky, making it more likely to bind within your artery walls and produce plaque. So having citrus fruits in your daily diet can definitely help you stay safe from clogged arteries, high blood pressure, heart disease, and strokes. Not just that, but citrus fruits are also rich in both soluble and insoluble fiber. Insoluble fibers help in better digestion, and soluble fiber helps in managing blood sugar and cholesterol levels. Number 7. Soy the secret behind soy's cholesterol-lowering properties lies in its unique bioactive compounds such as isoflavones and saponins. These plant-based compounds have been shown to prevent cholesterol production in the liver, reducing levels of bad cholesterol in the blood. For example, the isoflavones found in soy have been shown to reduce LDL cholesterol and slightly increase HEL cholesterol levels. Plus, they are known to be powerful antioxidants. Similarly, saponins in soy have the ability to interfere with the absorption of cholesterol in the intestines, which can be good if you already have high cholesterol levels in your blood. But do remember that isoflavones are phytoestrogens, meaning they have a structure similar to the hormone estrogen. Although that shouldn't be a concern if you are having soy products in moderate amounts, however, if you are already going through symptoms of hormonal imbalances, it's best to ask your health expert before making soy products a regular part of your diet. Anyhow, if you want to enjoy these cholesterol-lowering benefits of soy, you can simply start using soy milk instead of cow's milk, enjoying soy-based yogurt, or having tofu or tempeh in your favorite recipes. Besides, you can enjoy other healthy options of carbs to lower your bad cholesterol, as we have shown you in this video. Thank you for watching and subscribing to the channel. See you in the next video.